Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. Find all the photos that you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? This is that Jack Danbeck with another Every Super 7 video. This time we're talking about Every Super 7 reaction figures for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So series one was put out kind of weird. Uh, two different sets of series one figures. Here is your first set with your Leonardo, Raphael, Bebop, and Rocksteady. Front and back of each one of those figures with their weapons as well. Each turtle does come with a pizza. So here's your Raphael. Comes with his sigh and of course, like I said, the pizza. Nice promotional shots from this series one. Here's your Leonardo, comes with his katana blades, and of course the pizza. There's that promotional image. Now these are five points of articulation. Three and three quarter inch figures. You got your Rocksteady with his knife and his gun. Back of the package there. And it does show off both sets of one and two on the back of this package. Villains on one side, heroes on the other. But they did come separately. Uh, like I said, two turtles two villains in each. So there he is with his knife, his gun from the back. So these have that really reminiscent of the old Star Wars 3 and 3 quarter inch 5 points of articulation. There's that promotional image of him. Here is your Bebop with his shell drill. Again with the back of the card. Front and back of the figure. It's got a nice ponytail up there. Here is his promotional image. So again, that is the first four figures in series one on card. So here is series two, which are Shredder, Michelangelo, Foot Soldier, and Donatello. So here's your Michelangelo with his nunchucks, and again a slice of pizza. Back of the card, front and back of the figure. Donatello with his bow staff and the pizza slice. Here's your shredder figure, back of the card. He's got his sword and his kind of soft goods, plasticky cape there. And here's the foot soldier with the back of the card. And he does come with a shell biter weapon. Of course, this is your army builder for the set. That is all four from the second release of Wave 1. And there's all eight of the figures on card from Wave 1. And a little close up of the back of that uh, card as well. Right, so the next thing we jump into is an exclusive, a 2019 SDCC box set with all four turtles in a pizza box. So that's pretty awesome. So each turtle comes on a different card uh, or a slice of pizza with different toppings so you got Michelangelo with his jelly beans Raphael with his pepperonis Donatello with his pickles and Leonardo with clams it's a really cool little setup here they had and the next we have the 2020 exclusive uh, which is a glow in the dark Ooze canister. So that's really cool. TCRI on the side of the box. There you see them glowing in the dark. So all four turtles, all four pizzas, and then they got their weapons as well. So here's all four sides of the box. The mailer box, I should say. It's the top and the bottom of that box. All right, here we go with wave two. So again, wave one was huge and split up two different ways, but this is wave two. 
six different figures. You got your Krang, Splinter, April, and Baxter as regular figures. And then you got your Turtles in Disguise with Donnie and Raphael. So like I said, these are the playing characters. But here is your Donnie, or Undercover Donnie, with his bow staff. And the back of the card, you show on the back of the card, wave one up top and wave two below it. Nice promotional image of him. Here is your Space Cadet Raphael. He's got his ninja space suit. Here's your April O'Neil with a camcorder and a, I believe she has a microphone as well in there. Back of the card. No, it looks like she's got throwing stars. Interesting. Here's your crane with his mechanized body. And guys, I hadn't mentioned it yet, but I do love the artwork on these packages. That's a really cool bit of artwork there, especially for Krang. Here's your Baxter Stockman, back of the card. Here's the figure himself. No weapons, but he does have his wings. It says that his weapon is his insane intellect. <laughs> And here is your splinter with his bow staff. It's a really cool way to. Your splinter alongside of the Wave 1 Turtles. Just give you a size comparison. There's all six cards for this Wave 2. Alright, jumping into Wave 3, we have four figures this time revealed. Close up of it here. Jumping into the one basic figure, you have your Casey Jones with broken bats and golf club. Again, with the card artwork, that is amazing looking. It says that's a golf club, but I'm not sure. That looks more like a hockey stick. Here is your Sewer Samurai Leo with his samurai sword and the shield as well running in the action and a little close up here's your sewer surfer Mike with his wave whipping wheel so that's what the throwing star is I guess but he's also got his cowabunga surfboard And then we got the busted foot soldier with his shell biter. So again, an army builder here. And I do love the battle damage there. And again, that artwork on that card is spectacular. Little promotional image of him. And all four turtles, or sorry, all four figures on this wave in package here. All right, so we did get another exclusive. This was a preview set Mirage variant here with nice covers so it does have a lot of nostalgia to the old Eastman layered comic book covers there and all four turtles are in their ram bandanas that do come with a pizza slice each and their weapons They are a little closer up on the cards. Each one of them does have their name on it. I really love this artwork on these cards, especially because it does have that nostalgia to it. A little bit closer up on the pizza or the uh, turtles themselves, and you see every one of them does have a different face or expression as well. So let me correct myself. Technically, this is wave four. Uh, the first wave was actually all the turtles and the Shredder, Bebop, Rocksteady, and Foot Soldier. So that was wave one all together, even though they came separately. Uh, so this is technically wave four. Uh, so we have a preview of Mondo Gecko and Mutagen Man that we're going to be getting. And we also have the Ray Filet and Slash figures for this wave four of the Super 7 Reaction figures. So pretty cool picks. 
So we do have a leak of the back of the card for Wave 4 with the Ray Filet, Mondo Gecko, Slash, and Mutagen Man. So here is the Slash in package. In the back of the card with his write-up. You can see all four waves there on the back of the card as well. So that's pretty cool. And there's the figure with both of these accessories. Here's your Mondo Gecko on card with the back of the card there as well. You see he comes with a skateboard. And from the side you can tell his tail has that skate on the back of it, so that's pretty awesome too. We have our Mutagen Man here, front and back of the card. Again, I love the artwork on these cards. Look at that Mutagen Man artwork. There's the figure with his gun. And then lastly, we have our Ray Filet figure on package. And there he is with his accessories. So all four loose with their accessories. And all four on card. Nice wave. So for year two of the stay at home con, we did have a turtle from the reaction figures revealed and released. And it is also with a carrying case for your reaction figures. Got the turtle shell pattern on there. Also comes with a Michelangelo figure. So you come with a sticker pack there as well, $50 for this box here, or this carrying case. And you can put those stickers wherever you want to, I guess. There is your gold pizza and nunchucks Michelangelo. And thanks to October 3rd, 2021, we have a Fall Geek Out Collector Spotlight from Target for Super 7 exclusive figures. So we have this holiday special reaction figure pack here. Coming in a stocking. Got all four of your turtles dressed up in Santa hats with candy cane looking weapons and pizza. There's the back of the card looking like uh, it's a gift so you can actually use those and cut those out and put them on a gift if you want to for the gift tags. Got a nice bow on the top as well, that's pretty awesome. But there are all four of your turtles as I said with their candy cane pizzas and all of their individual weapons and their Santa caps. So guys, what do you think? I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave me any kind of comments. Hit the notification bell so you have any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that thumbs up and I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.